many shows come and go, but the ones which are remembered for many years are those which marked us in some way or another. This is clearly the case for Alaska, The Last Frontier, which is set apart from other Alaska-based shows for its genuineness and lack of dramatic plot lines often found in the genre. Nonetheless, while the uniqueness of the show is remarkable, what really made us love Alaska, The Last Frontier was its cast, their personalities, family values, work ethic, creativity, and endless resolve to make the best out of every day. Knowing we'll love Alaska, The Last Frontier, the question of whether or not the show will return to air for an 11th season comes up frequently. So when will it return? Or was it canceled for good? Stay with us to know it all. Since the end of Alaska, The Last Frontier's 10th season in early 2021, fans have patiently waited for a renewal, but no news about a renewal or cancellation has been announced yet. However, while Discovery has been quite secretive about the show's future, the same couldn't be said about the cast. In February 2021, Adsley Kilcher thanked fans for their support on the 10th anniversary on air of Alaska The Last Frontier, finishing his Instagram post with the following phrase, With a little luck, the season 11 will be right around the corner. While Adsley's posts seemed hopeful that a new season was coming, the lack of posts related to the show are evident, not only in his social media, but also on the rest of the family's accounts. Even so, in August 2022, a curious fan asked Otto Kilcher if the presence of cameras on one of his Instagram's posts meant he was filming the show, to which he answered that he was hoping footage will air soon, making it clear that not everything is lost for fans. So while there's no future information about the upcoming Alaska The Last Frontiers season or an official release date, fans will surely see their favorite stars on TV again in the near future. Whether there's still a chance of Alaska The Last Frontier coming back on air, we would surely like to be updated on the cast's whereabouts, so where are the Kilchers now? Regardless of the lack of new Alaska The Last Frontier episodes, everyone's favorite homesteader, Atz Kilcher, is as active as ever, as seen on his social media. Atz is still living in the Kilcher homestead in Alaska, where his family has been established for several decades. Along with his wife, Bonnie, he manages the Atz Kilcher Alaskan Adventure Cabins, an alternative hosting service located on his property on the family's homestead. According to the business's site, the couple offers their customers several types of activities and entertainment, such as singing and storytelling performances, on top of allowing them to enjoy numerous outdoor adventures and simply have a good time surrounded by nature and Alaska's landscapes. In May 2022, Ads underwent his third trigger finger release surgery on his right hand, a procedure meant to ease the mobility of his fingers. However, regardless of this issue, Atz is having a good time thanks to his endless love for music and arts, leading him to perform in local festivals and even being awarded by the American Society of Composers, Authors and Publishers, ASCAP, for his song, Alaska The Last Frontier, made for the show of the same name, an achievement for which he thanked his daughter, Jewel, and his fans for their support. All in all, it seems that everything is going well for Atz. There's no way to watch Alaska The Last Frontier without gaining endless inspiration from Otto Kilcher and his many talents. Although his resourceful nature shouldn't be a surprise, considering that he grew up in Alaska's extremely cold temperatures and wild nature, it's always impressive how inventive and creative Otto is. However, due to the show's prolonged absence from TV in recent times, we've been unfortunately deprived of seeing Otto working on his impressive projects on screen. As well, he doesn't let us see much about his engineering ways on his social media, but at least he hasn't refrained from showing us some glimpses of his gardens, homestead deeds, personal life, or even just celebrating the visit of his sister Wurzy, who has been living in Germany for a long time. Regarding Otto's health, many fans often wonder what's wrong with him nowadays, considering that in 2016 he underwent hernia surgery and suffered further complications from it. Nonetheless, it's relieving to know that even if back then his life was in serious risk, currently he seems to be in perfect health. Although she's not a kilter by blood, the audience of Alaska The Last Frontier couldn't help but be charmed by Charlotte Kilcher, wife of Otto. While her husband keeps his social media mostly focused on the family's homestead, Charlotte actually led us into some interesting details about her life in Alaska, her children's achievements, and pets. Charlotte also harvests several types of flowers and fruits for sale, especially peonies. Last but not least, Charlotte and Otto manage Alaska Frontier Living, located on the Kilcher property. Due to Charlotte and Otto's shared love of nature, 
Their homestead offers a wide variety of fruits and veggies, on top of giving their visitors a unique experience in the backcountry, without forgetting their commitment to environmental causes and recycling while doing so. Hopefully those who can't experience visiting the homestead in person can get a glimpse of it when the new Alaska The Last Frontier season eventually airs. Despite the challenges which come with living in the backcountry, life in Alaska seems as peaceful and charming as we remembered, thanks to what Ats Lee and Jane Kilcher show us on their social media. For his part, Ats Lee spends his days helping out with the heavy work around the family's homestead. In August 2022, he showed his Instagram followers some of his recently finished summer projects, such as the cabin he built for his father, preparing provisions for the upcoming winter, and overall enjoying some of his favorite outdoor activities, including fishing, hunting, and skiing. Jane also enjoys quite a lot of activities in the snow, but it was especially thrilling when in mid-2022, she announced an upcoming appearance in Bering Sea Gold with the show's main star, Emily Rydell, who's a longtime friend of Jane and who also appeared in Alaska The Last Frontier in years prior. Regarding whether the couple will appear in their family's show's new season, Jane affirmed on Facebook that indeed they have been filming the show, though a premiere date hasn't been decided by August 2022. Although Alaska The Last Frontier isn't your typical drama-inducing reality show, that doesn't mean its stars are free from controversy, especially when it comes to Ats Lee Kilcher. It all goes back to 2015, when he was severely injured while hiking in Alaska's Otter Cove Resort, breaking his arm, shoulder, ankle, hip, crushing some ribs, and puncturing a lung after falling off a cliff. As expected, Ats Lee's healing process was long, taking him several months of physical therapy to actually get out of bed again. I can't complain, all considering. I still have my health, family and friends, and that is a blessing for sure. He wrote on Instagram in August 2016, exactly a year after his accident. Well, fortunately, Atsley was able to return to his old routines with a lot of effort. He eventually filed a $100,000 lawsuit against the resort as he considered that they had failed to adequately warn of and or provide measures to prevent guests and other individuals from falling over the precipice at the resort, as reported by The Blast. The resort quickly denied having any responsibility for the incidents and injuries sustained by Atsley on their property, but it's unknown if they finally settled the issue out of court or the case was simply dismissed. As far as it's known, Atsley Kilcher's lawsuit against the resort, in which he had his accident, didn't put any party in serious trouble. He's nevertheless had some legal problems. As it happens, in 2014, Atsley and wife Jane were hunting bears, apparently using a helicopter to do so, while according to Anchorage Daily News, was the reason they were charged with one count of unlawful methods of taking or attempting to take big game by helicopter, almost one year after the incident took place near Homer. As reported, the then spokesperson for Alaska State Troopers affirmed that authorities were tipped off about the issue by a former staff member of Alaska The Last Frontier, and after getting a hold of the incident's footage, it was determined that the couple had broken the law. That being said, the show's producers didn't address the issue, making it unclear whether or not set footage was included in the show's filming. Nonetheless, it's confirmed that the production company, Wilma TV, was also charged for facilitating the helicopter boarded by Atsley and Jane in the incident. The resulting sentence is unknown. Despite not being the main stars of Alaska The Last Frontier, Ivan Kilcher and his wife Eve are surely memorable to everyone who ever saw the show. Just like his father Otto, Ivan grew up surrounded by nature, learning his way in hunting, fishing, and overall developing skills to sustain himself in the harsh environmental conditions and sustain his homestead. Not only does Ivan's wife, Eve, share his expertise in the outdoors, but also his less widely known passion for cooking. In 2016, they co-authored the book, Stories and Recipes from Our Hearth to Yours, featuring several recipes both created or improved by the couple, including those passed down to them as a family tradition. Nowadays, the couple own their own homestead, offering several plans for their visitors, such as teaching smokehouse building and cooking classes for kids. Even though it's unknown if Ivan and Eve will appear in future Alaska The Last Frontier seasons, their very active social media accounts and website can satisfy their most devoted fans' need for content. Even though the Kilchers aren't exactly known for revealing too much on social media, Shane and Kelly are even more reserved when it comes to their public life compared to the rest of the family. However, some details about their current life in Alaska are still known through their social media. 
Apparently, they're still happily living in the Kilcher homestead, where they take care of their farm, pets, and gardens. While their outdoor deeds don't seem to be anything unusual, their family has been blessed recently with the arrival in July 2022 of their youngest granddaughter, Anastasia, daughter of Jenna Kilcher. Also that year, Shane and Kelly hit their 30th wedding anniversary mark. Although it's unknown if we will see Shane and Kelly in the upcoming Alaska The Last Frontier seasons, it's relieving to know they're doing fine. While most of the cast of Alaska The Last Frontier gained fame through the show, Jewel Kilcher is known for something very different than homesteading. Famous for songs such as You Were Meant For Me, the multi-award-winning Jewel has sold millions of albums and has been nominated for several Grammys. However, while her recognition as a pop star is impressive, Jewel stays loyal to her family roots in Alaska. Even though she wasn't present in early seasons of Alaska The Last Frontier, she debuted in the show in 2016 after being away from her home for seven years. Despite not being a recurring star of the show, her relationship with her father, Atz, has fortunately improved compared to her early years. And as seen on social media, it's apparently not rare to see them performing together these days. Currently, Jewel often spends quality time with her family in Alaska while still actively releasing music as well as being a philanthropist. Even though it's unknown if Jewel will appear in further seasons of the show, for now, we're just glad to know that the Kilcher family overall is not only doing well, but also that their comeback to TV may well come sooner than expected. Thank you for spending some time with us. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpick these videos, which we recommend you watch next. You can talk to us on all social medias or ask a question in the comments below. Thank you for being with us and we'll see you back tomorrow.